Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 17th Orange Prize for Fiction shortlist announcement breakfast. Um, those of you who have been here most years will remember that we always want to either do the long list or the short list for the Orange Prize for Fiction at the London Book Fair. The Orange Prize was founded to get wonderful books by women from all over the world into the hands of male and female readers who would appreciate them. That's always been our aim and each year it goes better and better and there are more countries in the world that because of this shortlist and long list will be translating and promoting those writers. So we are very thrilled about that and I'd like to thank you all for the enormous amount of support you've given over the past 17 years. It's now my great pleasure to introduce the chair of the 2012 panel, Joanna Trollope, to announce the 2012 shortlist. Joanna. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much indeed for coming. Um, I just want to say very briefly that this has been an absolutely amazing year. Um, not just the quality of the judging panel, which is very high and has been very amicable, but also incredible quality of submissions. We've been really, really lucky in the books that have been available in this window from April 11 to April 12, and we're deeply appreciative of that and feel very, very congratulatory to an enormous number of authors, not just the six I'm going to announce now. We all, as judges, were very conscious of the um, Orange Prize's marvellous three-pronged edict of excellence, originality and accessibility. And to that, I would also add this year, distinction. Incredibly distinguished books and really so many congratulations to the authors and both the shortlist and the longlist are available to buy at the bookshop shop just behind you when I've made the announcement which I now will do in alphabetical order. So the shortlist for the Orange Prize 2012 consists of the following six novels. Half-Blood Blues by Essie Edigian, published by Serpent's Tale. The Forgotten Waltz, published, written by Anne Enright, and published by Jonathan Cape. Painter of Silence, written by Georgina Harding, and published by Bloomsbury. The Song of Achilles, written by Madeline Miller, published by Bloomsbury. Foreign Bodies by Cynthia Ozick, published by Atlantic Books. And State of Wonder by Anne Patchett, published by Bloomsbury. Go forth and enjoy six perfectly, astonishingly good books. Thank you so much.